Shabbat Shalom. We want to welcome everyone to our morning service and thank you very much for joining us. As usual, we'll do the service from two Sidorim as we normally do on Saturday morning. We begin with the Silverman prayer book and then we continue with the Gates of Prayer on page 290. But we begin with the Silverman prayer book as we begin our service with the Mato Vu prayer, expressing our gratitude to God for our homes of worship, and we're extremely grateful to God for all of our homes of worship. And we're especially blessed to be a part of Congregation Irving Havara in Irving, Congregation Temple Bethel in Corsicana, Congregation Temple Bethel in Brownsville, and Temple Beth Israel in Harlingen, Texas. And we're very grateful to God for all of our homes of worship. We express that gratitude in the Mato Vu prayer, which we begin on page 40. Two <laughs> How precious is thy loving kindness, O God! The children of men take refuge under the protection of thy sheltering care. They shall be abundantly satisfied in thy house, and thou shalt refresh them with thy living waters. For with thee is the fountain of life. In thy light do we see light. O continue thy loving kindness unto those who know thee, in thy righteousness to the upright in heart. We continue on the bottom of page 43. Baruch ata Adonai Eloheinu melech olam Asher kitshanu b'mitzvot avetzivanu al netilat yodahim We continue on page 44 in the Hebrew. Baruch ata Adonai Eloheinu melech olam Asher Yatsar et Adam Bachachma Uvaravona Kavim Nakavim Chalulim Chalulim Golui Viadua Lifne Chise Chabodecha Sheim Yipote Achechod Mehem O Yisote Mechod Mehem Ef Shar Lit Kayem Vila Amod Lefot Necha Baruch ata adotnai, 
Rofe Chobosur, Umaf Leila Asut, Baruch Ata Adonai, Eloheinu Melech Olaham, Asher Kitshanu, B'mitzvotav, V'tzivanu, La'asok V'divrei Torah, V'arev Na Adonai Eloheinu, Et divrei Torah Techa B'finu, Ubafi Amacha Beit Yisrael, V'niye Anachnu, V'tzetzoeinu, V'tzetzoe Amacha Beit Yisrael, Kulanu Yoda Eishimecha, V'lam Dei Torah Techa Lishma, V'aruch Ata Adotnai, Hamlam Bei Torah Liyama Yisrael, V'aruch Ata Adonai, Elo, hey, new Malach Olaham, Asher Bochar Banu Mikol Hamim, Venatan Lanu et Torato, Baruch Ato Adonai, Nahotain Hatura, Yibarecha Adonai Vishmerecha, Yo er Adonai Ponove Lecha Vichuneka. Yisa Adonai Pana Vilecha, Vyasim Lecha Shalom. We continue on the bottom of page 44 from the Mishnah. In the fulfillment of the following mitzvot, no fixed measure is imposed. Leaving the corner of the field for the poor, the gift of the first fruits, the pilgrimage offering at the sanctuary on the three festivals, Deeds of loving kindness in the study of the Torah. With regard to the fulfillment of the following mitzvot, a man enjoys their fruit in this life, while the principle remains for him to all eternity. Honoring one's father and mother, performing deeds of loving kindness, attending the house of study morning and evening, hospitality to wayfarers, visiting the sick, dowering the bride, attending the dead to the grave, devotion in prayer, and the making of peace between man and his fellow. But the study of the Torah is equivalent to them all. We continue on the top of page 45 in the English. O oh my God, the soul which which thou didst endow me is pure. Thou didst create it and fashion it. Thou didst breathe it into me, and thou preserved it within me. Thou wilt reclaim it from me, but thou wilt restore it to me in the life to come. So long as the breath of life is within me, I will give thanks unto thee, O Lord my God, and God of my fathers, Master of all works, Lord of all souls. Blessed art thou, O Lord, who restorest life to mortal creatures." We continue in the middle of page 45 in the Hebrew. Baruch ato Adonai Eloheinu melech ha'olam Asher natan lasech vivina Lahavchim vein yom uvein loyla Baruch ato Adonai Eloheinu melech ha'olam Sha'asani v'tzalmo Baruch ato Adonai Eloheinu melech ha'olam she'asani ben chorin. Baruch ato Adonai. Eloheinu melech ha'olam she'asani Yisrael. Baruch ato Adonai. Eloheinu melech ha'olam pokeach ivrim. Baruch ato Adonai. Eloheinu melech ha'olam malbiish arumim. Baruch ata Adonai, Eloheinu melech ha'olam, matir asurim. Baruch ata Adonai, Eloheinu melech ha'olam, zokeif kafufim. Baruch ata Adonai, Eloheinu melech ha'olam, rokal ha'aretz al ha'moyim. Baruch ata Adonai, Eloheinu melech ha'olam, she'asa likod zarki. Baruch ato Adonai, Eloheinu melech ha'olam, asher heichin mitzadei gover. Baruch ato Adonai, 
Eloheinu melech ha'olam, Ozer Yisrael bing v'ura. Baruch ata Adonai, Eloheinu melech ha'olam, Oter Yisrael b'tifara. Baruch ata Adonai, Eloheinu melech ha'olam, Hanotein le'oef ka'uach. We continue on page 46 in the Hebrew. Baruch ata Adonai, Eloheinu melech ha'olam, Hama avir shein nam einai ut nu mame afapoi vi ratzon milafonecha Adonai Eloheinu velo he avoteinu shetargi leinu b'toratecha v'dabekeinu b'mitzvotecha va'at vi einu lo li dechet v'lo li de avera. Va'ava um v'lo li de nisa yon, v'lo li de visa yon. Va'at ha'shlet v'anu yetzir ha'ra, v'har chikainu me'adam ra, u'me'chavir ra. V'dabakainu v'yetzir ha'tov, u'v'ma'asim tovim, v'chof et yetzrinu l'hishtabed lach. Utnenu hayam, uvachayam lechain, ulechesed, ularachamim, beinecha, uvenecha roenu, vetigmelenu chasadim tovim, varocha eto adonai, gomer chasadim tovim, la amo yisrael. And we continue in the middle of page 46 in the English. May it be thy will, O Lord my God and God of my fathers, to deliver me this day and every day from arrogance and from arrogant men, from every corrupt person, from every evil companion and neighbor, and from all mishap, from the dangers that lurk about me, from a harsh judgment and an implacable opponent, whether or not he'd be an adherent of our faith. At all times, man should revere God, even in private, acknowledging the truth and speaking the truth in his heart. As he rises in the morning, let him declare, Sovereign of all worlds, not because of our righteousness do we offer our supplications before thee, but because of thy great mercies. What are we? What is our life? What is our goodness? What our righteousness? What our help? What is our strength? What is our might? What can we say before thee, O Lord our God, and God of our fathers? Are not the mightiest is not before thee, and men of renown as though they were not? Wise men as if they were without knowledge, and men of understanding as though they were lacking in discernment. For in thine eyes the multitude of their works is emptiness, and the days of their life mere vanity. The preeminence of man over beasts would be naught, all would be vanity, were it not that we are thy people, children of thy covenant, descendants of Abraham thy beloved, to whom at Mount Moriah thou didst give thy promise, seed of Isaac his only son, who was bound upon the altar, the congregation of Jacob thy firstborn, whom thou didst name Israel and Yeshurun, out of thy love for him, and thy delight in him, It is therefore our duty to give thanks unto thee and extol thee, to bless and hallow thy name in offering thee praise and thanksgiving. Happy are we, how goodly is our portion, how pleasant our lot, how beautiful our heritage. Happy are we who pray morning and evening, declaring twice every day, Shema Yisrael Adonai Eloheinu Adonai Echad, Boruch shem kavod malchuto laolam vaed. Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God, the Lord is one. Blessed be his glorious kingdom for ever and ever. We continue on page 290 in the gates of prayer, the Sha'arei Tefillah. <coughs> Vahaya ha'olam baruchu baruch o severishit baruch o merviose baruch gozer imakayim baruch marachim al haaretz 
Baruch Murachem al Habriot, Baruch Mashalem Sachar Tavli Reav, Baruch Ailo Ad Bekayam Lonetzach, Baruch Pode Umatsil Baruch Shemo, Bishvach Odebis Mirot, Nagadelacha, Unashabechacha, Unaforacha, Venaskir Shimacha, Venam Lichacha Malakainu, Elo Hainu, Yachid Che, Haola Mim, Melech Meshubach, Umafor Ade Ad Shemo Hagodaho, Baruch Ata Adot Nahe, Melech Mahulaho, Batishbach. Blessed is the one who spoke, and the world came to be. Blessed is the source of creation. Blessed is the one whose word is deed, whose thought is fact. Blessed is the one whose compassion covers the earth and all its creatures. Blessed is the living and eternal God, ruler of the universe, divine source of deliverance and help. With songs of praise we extol you and proclaim your sovereignty, our God and King, for you are the source of life in the universe. Blessed is the eternal King to whom our praise is due. We continue on the bottom of 290. The heavens declare the glory of God. The arch of sky reveals his handiwork. Day pours out speech to day. One night spreads knowledge to the other. They have no speech. They use no words. No voice of theirs is heard. Yet their call goes out through all the earth and their words to the edge of the universe. Let all who are righteous sing God's song. The upright do well to acclaim him. Thank the Lord on the harp. Accompany your chant with strings. Sing to him a new song. Grace your song with skillful play. For the word of the Lord holds good. His work commands our trust. He loves justice and right. His steadfast love fills the earth. The heavens were made by the word of the Lord, their starry host by the power of his thought. For he spoke, and it was. He commanded, and it stood firm. The Lord's plan will stand forever. His thought will endure for all time. He fashioned the hearts of us all. He understands the meaning of our lives. No king is saved by the power of his arms, no warrior by reason of his strength. The war horse will not help you, for all its strength it cannot save. Therefore we trust in the Lord, he is our help and our shield. In him will we rejoice, in his holy being will we trust. Let your steadfast love rest upon us, O Lord, as we put our trust in you. We continue on the bottom of page 292 with a beautiful song for the Sabbath day, Psalm 92. It is good to give thanks to the Lord, to sing hymns to your name, O Most High, to tell of your love in the morning, to sing at night of your faithfulness, to pluck the strings, to sound the lute, to make the harp vibrate. Your deeds, O Lord, fill me with gladness. Your work moves me to song. How great are your works, O Lord! How profound your design! The fool will never learn, the dullard never grasp this. The wicked may flourish like grass, all who do evil may blossom, yet they are doomed to destruction, while you, O Lord, are exalted for all time. See how your enemies, O Lord, see how your enemies shall perish, how all who do evil shall be scattered. You lift up my head in pride. I am bathed in freshening oil. I shall see the defeat of my foes. My ears shall hear of their fall. The righteous shall flourish like palms, grow tall like cedars in Lebanon. Rooted in the house of the Lord, they shall be ever fresh and green, proclaiming that the Lord is just, my rock in whom there is no wrong. And we go back to the last two sentences in Hebrew on page 293. Sadikato Omar Yifrach 
Scares ball of unknown, ye scares to lame. Bavet adonai, bachatz rot eloheinu yafrichu. Oh, We continue in the middle of page 294 with Ashrei. <speaking in Hebrew> Asherei ha'am she'adonai ha'av Tehila le'david Aromim mecha Elohai ha'melech Ba'avarcha shimecha le'olam va'ed V'chayam avarachecha V'halala shimecha le'olam va'ed G'adol adonai u'mahulal ma'od V'lig du lato ein cheker, dor le dor yishabach maasecha, u'gevuro techo yagidu. Hadar kabod hodecha, v'divrei niflo techo asicha, v'ezuz nor o techo yomeru, u'gedu lo techo asap rena, zecher rav, to the Choya be oo, the seed caught the Choya at Nitinu, Hanun, Varachum, I don't know, Erecha Pim, Ugado Hosid, Tov, I don't know, Elako, Varacham of Alcol, myself, Yo do, I don't know, Ecoma, Gavod malachu techa yomeru, u'gavura techa yadaveru, lahodia livne ha'adon gavura tehav, u'chavod hadar malachu techa, malachu techa malachu kol olamim, u'mem shale techa b'chador v'ador, so mech adonai lecha hanof lehim. There's okay flecha hakfu fihim, ene chol e lecha yisabeiru, the atono tain lohem et achlam beito, poteach et yadecha, umaspia lecho chai ratzon, tzadik adonoi bechod rachov, bechasid bechoma asov. Korov Adonai lecho korov, lecho asher, yikra'u ve'emet. Ratzon yurei av ya'aseh, ve'et shabotam yishmav yoshim. Shomer Adonai et kol ohavahav, ve'et kol harsho'im yashmihit. Tehilat Adonai yedaber pihi, vivarech kabasar shim kodesho le'olam v'ed, v'anach nunavarech ya, me'atav ad olam, hallelujah. Well, we'll continue on page 297, the top of 297, with the beautiful Psalm 150. Alleluia, 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 
Let every living soul bless your name, O Lord our God, and let every human being acclaim your majesty forever and ever. Through all eternity you are God. We have no king but you. God of all ages, ruler of all creatures, Lord of all generations, all praise to you. You guide the world with steadfast love, your creatures with tender mercy. You neither slumber nor sleep. You awaken the sleeping and arouse the dormant. You give speech to the silent, freedom to the enslaved, and justice to the oppressed. To you alone we give thanks. Though our mouths should overflow as a song as a sea, our tongues with melody as the roaring waves, our lips with praise as the heaven's wide expanse, and though our eyes were to shine as the sun and the moon, our arms extend like eagles' wings, our feet speed swiftly as deer. Still we could not fully thank you, Lord our God, and God of all ages, or bless your name enough for even one of your infinite kindnesses to our ancestors and to us. Therefore, O God, limbs and tongue and heart and mind shall join to praise your name. Every tongue will yet affirm you, and every soul give you allegiance. As it is written, all my limbs shall say, Lord, who is like you? And David sang, Bless the Lord, O my soul, and let all that is within me bless his holy name. We continue in the Hebrew in the middle of page 299. Shechain Ad Marom V'kadoshim V'chatuf Ranenu Tzadikim V'adonai L'yesharim Navatai La Bafisharim tit hat lal, uvni vreit sadikim tit borach, uvi lashon chasidim tit rope moham, uvi kerev kadoshim tit gatash, uvi makat lot, riva vot, amachabet yisrael. Barina eat for our shimachom alakainu, Bechador vador. 
ישתבח שמך לעד מלכנו, האל המלך הגדול והקדוש בשמיים ובארץ. ברוך אתה אדוני אל מלך גדול ותשפחות אל ההודעות אדון הנפלאות הבוחר בשירי זמרו מלך אלוכי העולמים. We continue on the bottom of page 300 with the Chatsi Kaddish. Yit Kaddal v'yit Kaddash Shmei Rabba V'yadama Divara Chirute V'yam Lichwachute V'chayechon V'yomechon V'chayedecha Beit Yisrael Ba'agala Ba'agala v'zman k'ariv v'imru amen. Yehesh me'erav v'vorach l'olam u'l'olam v'almoya yitvorach. Yitvorach v'yishtabach v'yitvar. Viet rope mom, Viet na say, Viet na dar, Viet da le, Viet ta lal, Shemay de kudisha, Brech le la, Min kabir chata, Vashira hata, Tush bachata, Vanechemata, Da amiran, Vialama, V'imaru ha'amein. V'archet adotnei ha'mavorach v'arach adonai ha'mavorach Amavorach le'olam v'ed. We continue on page 301 with the responsive reading. Praise be the Lord our God, ruler of the universe, who makes light and creates darkness, who ordains peace and fashions all things, with compassion he gives light to the earth and all who dwell there. With goodness he renews the work of creation continually, day by day. How manifold are your works, O Lord! In wisdom you have made them all. The earth is full of your creations. Let all bless you, O Lord our God, for the excellence of your handiwork and for the glowing stars that you have made. Let them glorify you forever. Blessed is the Lord, the maker of light. Deep is your love for us, O Lord our God, and great is your compassion. Our maker and king, our ancestors trusted in you, and you taught them the laws of life. Be gracious now to us and teach us. Have compassion upon us, O source of mercy, and guide us to know and understand. Learn and teach, observe and uphold with love, all the teachings of your Torah. Le'olam v'ed V'lo nevosh Le'olam v'ed Ki v'shem k'ad shecha 
Nagila vanismcha, Nagila vanismcha vishu atecha, ki el po el yeshu ot ata, uvon uvon charta, veke rav tanu leshimcha, hagado selo beemet, lehodot lecha, uliachedcha, vaahava. Baruch ata adot noe, abocher baamo Yisrael biahava. Enlighten us with your teaching. Help us to hold fast to your mitzvot, and unite our hearts to love and revere your name. Then shall we never be shamed, for we shall put our trust in you, the great, holy, and awesome one. We shall rejoice and be glad in your salvation. For you, O God, are the author of many deliverances. In love you have chosen us and drawn us near to you to serve you in faithfulness and to proclaim your unity. Blessed is the Lord who in love has chosen his people Israel to serve him. Shema Yisrael Adonai Eloheinu Adonai Echad Baruch Shem Kevod Machuto Leolam Vaed Hear, O Israel, the Lord is our God, the Lord is one. Blessed is his glorious kingdom forever and ever. Ve'avta et Adonai Elohecha v'cha levavcha u'v'cha nafshecha u'v'cha ma'odecha v'ayu hadevarim ha'ele ha'ashir hanochi v'tzavcha Ha'ayom ha'levavecha V'shinantam levatnecha v'dibartabam V'shivtecha v'veitecha U'velechtecha v'adirech u'v'shachwecha u'v'kumecha U'kshartam liot al yadecha V'ahayu L'totafot b'in einecha Uchtavtam al mezuzot b'itecha u'vishorecha You shall love the Lord your God with all your mind, with all your strength, with all your being. Set these words which I command you this day upon your heart. Teach them faithfully to your children. Speak of them in your home and on your way when you lie down and when you rise up. Bind them as a sign upon your hand. Let them be a symbol before your eyes. Inscribe them on the doorpost of your house and on your gates. Be mindful of all my mitzvot and do them. So shall you consecrate yourselves to your God. I, the Lord, am your God, who led you out of Egypt to be your God. I, the Lord, am your God. True and enduring, Beloved and precious, awesome, good, and beautiful is this eternal teaching. This truth we hold to be forever certain. The eternal God is our King. He is a rock of Jacob, our protecting shield. He abides through all generations. His name is eternal. His throne stands firm. His sovereignty and faithfulness are everlasting. His words live and endure true and precious to all eternity. Lord our God, you redeemed us from Egypt. You set us free from the house of bondage. For this the people who felt your love sing songs of praise to you. The living God, high and exalted, mighty and awesome, who humbles the proud and raises the lowly, who frees the captive and redeems the oppressed, who is the answer to all who cry out to him? Jehilot el elyon 
Baruch Uvavorach Moshe Uvene Yisrael Lecha Anushira Basim Charabah Vamruch Laham. All praise to God Most High, the source of blessing. Like Moses in Israel, we sing to him this song of rejoicing. <laughs> Ba'elim Adonai Mi'chamocha Nedar Ba'kodesh No rata hilot A'oseifele No rata hilot A'oseifele Shira Chadasha Shibachu Gulim Le Shimacha Asafat Hayam Yachad Kudam Hodu Vim Lichuv Amaru Adot Naim Loch Leolam Vaed Zur Yisrael Kumab Ezrat Yisrael Ufadei chin umecha, Yehuda v'Yisrael, Go aleinu, Adonai tzvot shemo, Kedosh Yisrael, Baruch ata Adonai, Go al Yisrael. We continue on page 306 with the tefillah. Adot nesifotai tiftach ufi agid tehilatecha Baruch ato adot nai Eloheinu ve'elohe avoteinu Elohe Avraham, Elohe Yitzchak Velo he yakov, a el a godol, a gibor vahano raha, el el yon, go milk as a dim to vim, the cone a col, the zoher has de a boat, who may ving ula, Melech Ozer, Umoshia, Umagain, Borach, Aeta, Adonai, Magain of Raham, Atogi, Borleolam, Adonai, Mechaye, Akol, Ata, Rablochia, Mechakel, Chaim, Bechesed, Mechaye ako barachamim rabim. So mech nohflim verofech olim. Umatir asurim. Umakayem emunato. Lishene afar. Mechamocha baagavu rot. Umidomelach. Melech me meet, Umachaye, Umats me a Yeshua, Veneman ata, Lachayot hakol, Baruch ata adot nai, Machaye hakol, Nikade shechim chob olam. Kashem shemaknishim oto bishme morom kakatu valiad nevi echa vakara ze el ze vi amar kadosh 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 adot nights of oat malachon haretz kevodo. Adir Adirinu Adonai Adonainu Moadir Shimacho Bachal Aretz Baruch Kabod Adonai Mimko Mao Echad Eloheinu Hu Avinu 
Umaki nu, Moshi ain't new. Vayashmi ain't new. Brahamov. Lane kochoi. Ahani adonoi. Elohechem. Yim loch adonoi leolom. Elohaich tion. Le dor vodor. Le dor vodor. Le dor vodor. Nagid god lecha. Le dor vodor. Le dor vodor. The door of our door, Nagi God Lecha, Ulanay Tsach Litzachim, Kadushot Chonaktish, Kadushot Chonaktish, Vashim Chacha Elo, He knew me, Pinu Lo Yamush, Lo Yamush, Neo Lamba Ed, Baruch Ato Adot Noe. We'll continue on the top of page 309. The people of Israel shall keep the Sabbath, observing the Sabbath in every generation, as a covenant for all time. It is a sign forever between me and the people of Israel, for in six days the eternal God made heaven and earth. And on the seventh day he rested from his labors. Our God and God of ages past, may our rest on this day be pleasing in your sight. Sanctify us with your mitzvot, and let your Torah be our way of life. Satisfy us with your goodness, gladden us with your salvation, and purify our hearts to serve you in truth. In your gracious love, O Lord our God, let your holy Sabbath remain our heritage that all Israel, hallowing your name, may find rest and peace. Blessed is the Lord for the Sabbath and its holiness. We continue on page 310. Be gracious, O Lord our God, to your people Israel, and receive our prayers with love. O may our worship always be acceptable to you. Fill us with the knowledge that you are near to all who seek you in truth. Let our eyes behold your presence in our midst, and in the midst of our people in Zion. Blessed is the Lord, whose presence gives life to Zion and all Israel. We gratefully acknowledge that you are the Lord our God, and God of our people, the God of all generations. You are the rock of our life, the power that shields us in every age. We thank you and sing your praises for our lives which are in your hands for our souls which are in your keeping, for the signs of your presence we encounter every day, and for your wondrous gifts at all times, morning, noon, and night. You are goodness, your mercies never end. You are compassion, your love will never fail. You have always been our hope. For all these things, O sovereign God, let your name be forever exalted and blessed. O God, our Redeemer and Helper, Let all who live affirm you and praise your name in truth. Lord, whose nature is goodness, we give you thanks and praise. We continue with the beautiful words of peace on page 313. Sim Shalom. Sim, 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 shalom. Tova, 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 varacha, chen, chen, vachesed. Barachamim Aleinu Sim 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 Shalom Tova 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 Baracha Chain Chain Vachesed Barachamim Aleinu Be all call Yisrael Amecha Be all call Yisrael Amecha Be all call Yisrael, Yisrael, Amecha, Sim, 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 Shalom, Tova, 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 Baracha, Chain, 
Chain Vachesed, Verachamim Aleinu, Borachinu, Avinu, Kulanuke Echad, Baor Panecha Kibior, Panecha Natalanu, Adonai Eloheinu, Sim, Sim. Sim shalom, tova, tova, tova v'racha, chen, chen v'chesed, v'rachamim aleinu, tarat chayim v'yavat chesed, u'tzedaka v'racha v'rachamim, v'chayim v'shalom, sim, sim, Sim shalom, tova, tova, tova v'racha, chen, chen v'chesed, v'rachamim aleinu, v'tav b'einech alevorech et amacha Yisrael, v'cha eit v'cha shah, v'yishlomecha, sim, sim, Sim shalom, tova, tova, tova v'racha, chen, chen v'chesed, v'rachamim aleinu, baruch ato adonai, hamavorech et amo Yisrael, b'shalom. We'll pause for a moment of silent prayer on the bottom of page 313. Shalom bin Romav, hey, I say Shalom Aleinu, ve al-Kul Yisrael, ve imru, ve imru, amen. Oh, Shalom bin Romav, hey, I say Shalom Aleinu, ve al-Kul Yisrael, Ve'imru, ve'imru, amen. Yas shalom, yas shalom, shalom aleinu ve'al kol Yisrael. Yas shalom, yas shalom, shalom aleinu ve'al kol Yisrael. Yas shalom, yas shalom. Shalom Aleinu Yaqal Yisrael Yahas Shalom Yahas Shalom Shalom Aleinu Yaqal Yisrael Ve'imru Amen Well in just a moment we'll continue with the service for taking out the Torah that begins on page 417. We'll take the Torah out. We won't actually read from the Torah scroll today. We'll read from the Chumash, um, symbolizing our reading from, from the Torah. Before we begin the service for taking out the Torah on page 417, just a brief synopsis of today's Torah reading of Vayikra. Shabbat Shalom. This Shabbat, we begin reading the third book of the five books of Moses, the book of Leviticus. The Hebrew name for Leviticus is Vayikra, and it's taken from the opening word of the book, meaning, and he called. The book of Leviticus consists of 27 chapters and is divided into 10 weekly sidrot. The word Leviticus comes from the Greek and means about the Levites. This third of the five book of Moses deals with laws which apply to the Kohanim 
of the tribe of Levi, and laws for all of Israel. Among the many laws of Leviticus are those that deal with sacrifices, physical purity, moral instruction, the festivals, sabbatical, and jubilee years. The goal of all of these laws is to make of Israel a holy nation. The Torah reading of Vayikra Leviticus, which this week's reading is Leviticus 1 through 5, 26, tells of laws concerning sacrifices offered in the sanctuary, which was a house of worship for Israel as they slowly made their way from Egypt to the Promised Land. The offering of sacrifices was the chief way of worshiping God from the time of the wandering in the wilderness about 1220 BCE with the portable sanctuary through the times of Jerusalem's first and second temple about 13 centuries. Eventually, prayer to Philah replaced sacrifice as a form of worship for Israel. The Torah reading describes the various types of sacrifices which were brought into the sanctuary. The Ablo, the burnt offering, it was offered when a person felt guilty over a wrong which he had done. By bringing this sacrifice, the individual expressed his or her wish to come closer to God, to get over his feeling of guilt, and to do right in the future. The burnt offering could be of cattle, sheep, goats, or fowl. The mincha, the meal offering, the meal offering was offered by a person who felt guilty, but who could not afford to bring an animal sacrifice. This sacrifice consisted of flour mixed with oil and frankincense. The sh- shalomim, the peace or thanksgiving offering, this was a sacrifice offered by a person who wanted to express his appreciation to God for some good that had come to him or in, fu- or in fulfillment of a vow, the chatot, the sin offering. This was an animal sacrifice brought by one who committed a wrong accidentally and only found out later that it was a wrong. The oscho, the guilt offering. This was a ram sacrifice brought by the person who by error had used something for himself when it was really intended for use in the sanctuary. These sacrifices would be brought to the sanctuary where the Kohanim would accept them from the Israelite and prepare them for burning on the altar as gifts to God. That's a brief synopsis of today's Torah reading and the service for taking out the Torah will begin on page 417. Enkamocha va Elohim Adotnai v'enkamasecha Malachitcha malachit Kal olamim u'memshatcha v'chadar v'adar Adotnai me'olech I don't know I'm Allah. I don't know I'm Allah. Leo Laham Void. I don't know I'm Allah. I don't know I'm Allah. I don't know I'm Allah. I Eti vavirtsonecha etzion. Tivnecha umot Yerushalayim. Tivnecha umot Yerushalayim. Yivachalavad batachnu Melech Aram Venisa Adon Olamim
We'll continue. We'll continue with our symbolic aliyot today, and we'll re- we'll recite one aliyot today, and and recite, and then do one aliyah from the tour reading from the tour reading today. Traditionally, we would do um, three or seven, but today we're going to we're going to do one. It, it, this represents this represents everyone in the community, the Kohanim, the Levi'im, the Yisraelim. This represents everybody. Baruch et Adonai, Amavot Rach. Baruch Adonai, Amavot Rach. Leolam va'ed. Baruch ata Adotnai Eloheinu melech haolam Asher bachar ponu mikol ha'apmim V'natan lanu et turato Baruch ata Adotnai Notein ha'torah And we'll read, we'll read from the beginning of Vayikra, the beginning of Leviticus in the Hertz Chumashim. Amen. Vayikra El Moshe Vayidaber Adotnoi Elohav me ohel moed lehmor taper el bnei Yisrael 
v'omarta alehim adam ki yakrif mikem karban ladot noi min hab heif mo min habakar umin hatzun takrivu et karban chem im olah karbat no min habakar zachar tamim takrivenu el pesach oh hell. Mo'ed yakriv oto lirtsono lifne adotnae v'somach yado ahal rosh ha'olah v'nirtsa lo l'chaper ahalav. Vishachat et ben habakar lifne adot noi vehikrevu vatne aharon hakohat nihim et hadam vazaraku. Et Hadam al Hamispeach Saviv Asher Petach Ohel Mohed Vahiv Shit Et Olah Venitach Otah Lincha But nay, ah, run, I go, hey, reading will continue with the prophetic reading on page in her in her in the hertz Chumashim. the prophetic reading will begin on page 424 which we'll recite in the english just a very brief synopsis of today's prophetic reading the haftorah 
The prophetic reading is from the book of Isaiah, Isaiah 43, 21, 44 through 23. The prophet Isaiah gives a message to the people who have been exiled to Babylonia in 586 BCE. Israel has been defeated by the conquerors because they have failed to live up to God's expectations for them to be a righteous people among the nations of the world. The prophet Isaiah goes on to remind them that there is but one God in whom they must believe. As for the idols which other nations worship, Isaiah points out that they are foolish, that a man should take a block of wood and carve it into a figure, and then then bow down to it is certainly wrong. Let Israel now understand that they must return to an acceptance of God alone, for he is the one true ruler of the universe. He alone can and will redeem Israel. The thematic link between the Torah reading and the prophetic reading is the true worship of God by Israel, in its early years at the sanctuary, and they're falling away from God in the time of Isaiah. And we'll, con- and we'll continue with the blessings before the prophetic reading, which may be found, let's take a moment to get to the, the, page 1044 in the Hertz Chumashim, the blessings before the prophetic reading. Baruch Atah Adonai Eloheinu Melech Olam Asher Bachar Binavim Tovim Verats of Divrahim Han Emorim Vepmet Baruch Atah Adonai Ha bocher bato raha uva moshe avado uva yisrael amo uvin vie ha emet bat edek. The people which I form for myself, that they might tell of my praise. Yet thou hast not called upon me, O Jacob, neither. Hast thou wearied thyself about me, O Israel? Thou hast not brought me the small cattle of thy burnt offerings, neither hast thou honored me with thy sacrifices. I have not burdened thee with a meal offering, nor wearied thee with frankincense. Thou hast bought me no sweet cane with money, Neither hast thou satisfied me with the fat of sacrifices. But thou hast burdened me with thy sins. Thou hast wearied me with thine iniquities. I, even I, am he that blotteth out thy transgressions for mine own sake. And thy sins I will not remember. Put me in remembrance. Let us plead together. Declare thou that thou mayest be justified. Thy first father sinned, and thine intercessors have transgressed against me. Therefore I have profaned the princes of the sanctuary, and I have given Jacob to condemnation, and Israel to reviling. Yet now hear, O Jacob, my servant, and Israel, whom I have chosen. Thus saith the Lord that made thee, and formed thee from the womb, who will help thee. Fear not, O Jacob, thy servant, and thou, Yeshurun, whom I have chosen. For I will pour water upon the thirsty land and streams upon the dry ground. I will pour my spirit upon thy seed and my blessing upon thine offspring. And they shall spring up among the grass as willows by the water courses. One shall say, I am the Lord's, And another shall call himself by the name of Jacob. And another shall subscribe with his hand unto the Lord, and surname himself by the name of Israel. Thus saith the Lord, the King of Israel, and his Redeemer, the Lord of hosts, I am the first, and I am the last, and beside me there is no God. 
And who as I can con proclaim, let him declare it and set it in order for me, since I appointed the ancient people, and the things that are coming and that shall come to pass, let them declare. Fear ye not, neither be afraid. Have I not announced unto thee of old and declared it? And ye are my witnesses. Is there a God beside me? Yea, there is no rock, I know not any. They that fashion a graven image are all of them vanity, and their delectable things shall not profit, and their own witnesses see not nor know, that they may be ashamed. Who hath fashioned a god or molten an image that is profitable for nothing? Behold, all the fellows thereof shall be ashamed, and the craftsmen skilled above men. Let them all be gathered together, let them stand up, they shall fear, they shall be ashamed together. The smith maketh an axe, and worketh in the coves, and fashioneth it with hammers, and worketh it with his strong arm. Yea, he is hungry, and his strength faileth. He drinketh no water, and is faint. The carpenter stretcheth out a line, he marketh it out with a pencil, he fitteth it with planes, and he marketh it out with the compasses, and maketh after the figure of a man, according to the beauty of, of a man, to dwell in the house. He heweth him down cedars, and taketh the ilex and the oak, and strengtheneth for himself one among the trees of the forest. He planteth a bay tree, and the rain doth nourish it. Then a man useth it for fuel, and he taketh thereof, and warmeth himself, yea, he kindleth it, and baketh bread, yea, he maketh a god, and worshipeth it, and maketh it a graven image, and falleth down thereto. He burneth the half thereof in the fire, with the half thereof he eateth flesh, he roasteth his roast, and is satisfied, yea, he warmeth himself, and saith, Aha, I am warm, I have seen the fire. And the residue thereof he maketh a god, even his graven image. He falleth down unto it, and worshipeth, and prayeth unto it, and saith, Deliver me, for thou art my god. They know not, neither do they understand. For their eyes are debobbed that they cannot see, and their hearts that they cannot understand. And none considereth in his heart, neither is their knowledge nor understanding to say, I have burned the half of it in the fire. Yea, also I have baked bread upon the coast thereof. I have eaten, I have roasted flesh and eaten it. And shall I make the residue thereof an abomination? Shall I fall down to the stalk of a tree? He striveth after ashes. A deceived heart hath turned him aside, that he cannot deliver his soul, nor say, Is there not a lie in my right hand? Remember these things, O Jacob, and Israel, for thou art my servant. I have formed thee, thou art mine own servant. O Israel, thou shouldest not forget me. I have blotted out as a thick cloud transgressions, and as a cloud thy sins. Return unto me, for I have redeemed thee. Sing, O ye heavens, for the Lord hath done it. Shout, ye lowest parts of the earth. Break forth into singing, ye mountains, O forest, and every tree therein. For the Lord hath redeemed Jacob, and doth glorify himself in Israel. And we continue with the blessings after the prophetic reading on 1044. <laughs> Sur kol ha'olaf mihim, tzadik b'chol ha'dorot, ha'el ha'neman, ha'omer v'oseh, ha'medaber u'mekayim, she'kod devarov emet v'atzedek. Ne'eman atahu, Adonai Eloheinu, V'ne'emanim devarecha, v'davar echad midvarecha, ha'chor lo yashuv reikam, ki e'om melech 
נאמן ורחמן אתה, ברוך אתה אדוני, האל הנאמן בחד דבר רב. רחם על הציון, כי היא בית חיינו, ולעלו בת נפש תושיע, במהרה בימינו, ברוך אתה אדוני. משמח ציון בבת נאה, סמכנו אדוני אלוהינו. באליהו הנביא עבדך, ובמלכות בית דוד משיחך, במהרה יבוא ויעגל ליבנו. על כיסו לא ישב זר, ולא ינחלו עוד אחרים את כבודו. כי בשם קודשך נשפטת לו, שלא יכבה נרו לעולם ועד, ברוך אתה אדוני, מגן דוד, על התורה ועל העבודה ועל הנביאים ועל יום השבת הזה. שנתת לנו אדוני אלוהינו לקדושו ולמנוחו לכבוד ולתפארת. על הכל אדוני אלוהינו אנחנו מודים לך ומברכים אותך יתברך שמך בפי כוחי תמיד לעולם ועד ברוך אתה אדוני מקדש השבת. We'll continue with the service for returning the Torah to the Ark, beginning on the bottom of page 419. וזאת התורה אשר שמו שלפני בני ישראל על פי אדות נאי ביד משה. We continue on the bottom of 422. יאללה <laughs> Livene Yisrael, am Kerovo, Hallelujah, Hallelujah. Mis mor le David, Havu la dono ebene elim, Havu la dono ekavod vaos, Havu la dono ekavod shemo, השתחבו לאדוני בהדרת קודש. כל אדוני על המויים, אל הכבוד הרעים, אדוני על מים רבים. כל אדוני בכוח, כל אדוני בהדר. כל אדוני שובר ארזים. וישבר אדוני את ארזי הלבות נון, ביער קידם כמו עגל, לבנון וסיריון כמו בן רעמים. כל אדוני חוצב להבות אש, כל אדוני יאכיל מדבר, יאכיל אדוני מדבר קודש. כל אדוני יכול לאיילות, 
Baeches of Yerot, Vechalo Kulo Omer Kavod, Adon Elamo Bulyashov, Baeshev Adon Melech Leolam, Adon Osli Amo Yitin, Adon Yevo Orechet Amo we continue on the bottom of page 424 as we return the Torah to the Ark. Kach <laughs> The Rache O Darchena Uam Vachanati Vateha Shalom Hashivenu Adonai Shabbat Shalom. Just a very, very brief Devar Torah, then we'll have our concluding parts of the service. This Shabbat, we begin reading the third book of the five books of Moses, the book of Leviticus. As Rabbi Sidney Greenberg points out in his book, Torah Guidelines for Living Like a Mensch, of the five books of the Torah, Leviticus is the most difficult book for the modern reader. Unlike the book of Genesis that has stories that are child-friendly, a tremendous amount of the material in Leviticus is for adults, and it is largely concerned with the details of the ancient institution of animal sacrifice, which came to an abrupt end when the second temple in Jerusalem was destroyed almost 2,000 years ago. And yet, for all of its lack of appeal, stories, or drama, it was with the book of Leviticus that Jewish children in past ages would begin their study of the Torah, not the absorbing stories of Genesis, not the exciting events in Exodus, but the dry, uninspiring laws concerning sacrifices that constituted their introduction to sacred scripture. And the sages have always asked the question, why? And whenever the sages ask a question, of course, they answer the question. Our sages in the Midrash gave a charming answer to this question. Little children are pure, and the sacrifices are pure. So let those who are pure come and occupy themselves with things that are pure. However, there may be another reason why Jewish youngsters begin their Torah studies with Leviticus. Perhaps their teachers wanted to impress upon their young minds at their earliest opportunity the inescapable truth that sacrifice is at the very center of life. 
We will never accomplish anything without sacrifice, hard work, diligence, and perseverance. Nothing worthwhile is ever achieved without it. Moreover, and this might have been the most important reason, unless they learned the meaning of sacrifice in their own lives, they would never actually be able to make very much of themselves because, as we said, everything that we do in life takes sacrifice, hard work, diligence, and perseverance. When Isaac Stern concluded a concert recital one evening, he was approached by an ardent admirer who exclaimed rapturously, Oh, Mr. Stern, I would give anything to be able to play the violin as magnificently as you do, to which the maestro replied softly, Would you give 12 hours a day? And that is a fantastic, that is a fantastic answer. And um, I'm like that little story that, that, that Rabbi Greenberg included there about, about um, Isaac Stern. That's a fantastic story. As we are currently sheltering in place, our children are learning a lesson about sacrifice. That is, we are sacrificing our movement and they're sacrificing their movement so that all of us may enjoy longer, healthier lives especially a revealed elderly. So we're, we're restricting our movement. We're making that sacrifice, but we're doing it. We're doing it so that all of us can live longer, healthier lives. And we especially keep in mind our revealed, our revealed elderly. And I want to um, conclude with a little message that I concluded with yesterday evening but it but it's important for us to remember as we know and we've said this week we begin the biblical book of leviticus by Yikra, whose essential theme is that of sacrifice let us remember that we are sacrificing our movement temporarily to protect those whom we love and cherish especially our grandparents our senior citizens those who sacrificed on our behalf all their lives so that we would be the individuals that we are today. In Judaism and in the Torah, we revere our elderly. Now it is our time to convey to them our sincere love and gratitude. And in Judaism, we convey our beliefs through our actions. As we are sheltering in place, let us keep in mind the words from the book of Psalms, these beautiful words. I will bless the Lord at all times. His praise shall continually be in my mouth. My soul shall glory in the Lord. The humble shall hear thereof and be glad. O magnify the Lord with me and let us, and let us exalt his name together. I sought the Lord and he answered me. And he delivered me from all my fears. In peace will I both lay me down and sleep. For you, Lord, make me dwell alone in safety. And as we said, last Wednesday evening, we began the new month of Nisan. As we recited in our prayers for the new month, may this new month of Nisan bring life, hope, joy, peace, salvation, and comfort to us all. Shabbat Shalom, Shalom Uvracha, peace and blessings. And we'll continue on page 615 as we rise for Olenu, page 615. Olenu l'shabiyach l'adon hakol l'atet g'dula l'yotzer b'reshit Shelo asanu kugoye haaratzut Velo samanu kemishpacho adama Shelo sam chokeinu kachem Vagoraleinu kachal hamotnam Vanach nukwarim umishtachabim umodim Lifnei melech malachei hamalachim 
HaKadosh Baruch Shehu note shamayim v'yoset aretz U'moshav yekoro b'ashamayim mimaal U'shchin atuzo, u'shchin atuzo Bagav heimeromim Eloheinu ein od Emet mokeinu efesulatu Kakatu v'toratu V'adat ha'yom, v'adat ha'yom V'hashevoto elav ovecha Ki Adonai hu ha'elohim Vashomayim imal Viala aretz, viala aretz Mitochat ein od He spread out the heavens and established the earth. He is our God, there is none else. In truth, He alone is our King, as it is written. Know then this day, and take it to heart. The Lord is God in the heavens above, and on the earth below. There is none else. We therefore hope, O Lord our God, soon to behold the glory of your might. Then will false gods vanish from their hearts, and the world will be perfected under your unchallenged rule. And then will all acclaim you as their God, and forsaking evil turn to you alone. Let all who dwell on earth acknowledge, and unto you every knee must bend, and every tongue swear loyalty. Before you, O Lord our God, let them humble themselves. To your glorious name let them give honor. Let all accept the yoke of your kingdom, that you may rule over them soon and forever. For the kingdom is yours, and to all eternity you will reign in glory. As it is written, the Lord will reign forever and ever. But Nehemar, Vahaya Adotnai, the Melech on Kolaretz, Bayom Hahu, Bayom Hahu, Ye Adonai Echad, Ushemo, Ushemo, Ushemo and it has been said the lord shall reign over all the earth on that day the lord shall be one and his name shall be one we'll continue on page 629 with the mourner's cottage that we're going to recite in loving memory of all of our dear ones who have passed on and we especially want to remember dr jerry Gurkov, page 629. Yet Kadal, the Yet Kadash, Shemay Rabbah, the Alamad Ivara Hira Ute, the Amlich Machute, the Chaye Chon, Uva Yome Chon, Uva Chaye de Chabet Yisrael, the Agala, Uvis Mankari, the Imaru, Amen. Yehe Shemay Rabbah, Mavarach, the Olam Ulalme, Omaya. Yit barach, the Yishtabach, the Yit Faar, the Yit Romam, the Yit Nase, the Yit Hadar, the Yit Tale, the Yit Talal, Shemedikudisha, Brichu, La Ela, Min Kabirchata, the Shirata, Tushbachata, the Nechemata, the Amiram, the Alamav, Imaru, Amen. Yehe Shalama Rabba, Min Shemaya, B'chayim aleinu v'alkal Yisrael v'imaru. Amen. Ose shalom v'imromav. Hu ya'ase shalom aleinu v'alkal Yisrael v'imaru. Amen. May the source of peace send peace to all who mourn and comfort to all who are bereaved. Amen. And we'll continue with the Misha Berachim for those who are ill. Baruch atah Adonai, Rofei HaCholim. We praise you, O God, healer of the sick. Mishaberach Avotenu Abraham Yitzchak V'Yaakov Imatenu. 
Sarariv Korachel Valea, who you are frappe et Hacho Hacho Lim Hakodosh for Ochim or Le Rachamim, Alehem, La Hachali Mam Ulrapo Tom, La Hachayutom, Vishnach Flabim Hera, Rufua Salema, Mean Hashamim Rufua Hanefesh, Rufuta Gubbesach Archulim Yisrael, Hashtaba Agala, Ubisman Koriban Omar, Amen. O God who blessed our ancestors, Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, Sarah, Rebecca, Rachel, and Leah, send your blessings to all who are ill. Have mercy on them and graciously restore them to complete health, strength, and vigor. Grant them a refuah shalema, a complete recovery, along with all others who are ill. May complete healing come speedily, and let us say, Amen. Source of healing, cast the light of health, and well-being on those who have been exposed to coronavirus, those who have contracted the disease, and those, God forbid, who contract the disease in the future. Bless them, protect them, and bring them speedily to full recovery. Bless all who are ill with healing of body, healing of soul, and healing of spirit. Amen. We'll continue in just a moment with our concluding songs, beginning on page 730 with Enke Lo Hainu. Enke Lo Hainu, Enke Adonainu, Enke Mokainu, Enke Moshi Hainu, Meche Lo Hainu, Meche Adonainu, Meche Mokainu, Meche Moshi Hainu, No Dele Lo Hainu, No Dele Adonainu, No Dele Mokainu, No Dele Mokainu, Baruch Eloheinu, Baruch Adonainu, Baruch Malkeinu, Baruch Moshe'einu. Atahu Eloheinu, Atahu Adonainu, Atahu Malkeinu, Atahu Moshe'einu. We will conclude in just a moment with Yerushalayim Shel Zahav, Havan Agila, and Adonalam. And we'll continue with Yerushalayim Shel Zahav, Jerusalem of God, that we do in memory of Al Dunks, who was in Jerusalem in 1967 at the time that this beautiful song was composed.
continue with Havana Gila, and it is certainly fantastic to dwell together as, as brethren, as a congregation, as a community. It, it's wonderful, and, and we rejoice, and we're very, very happy, and Havana Gila really epitomizes our basic, basic essence and philosophy as Jews. Our operating word is joy, and this represents that. <laughs> Page 729, God is with us, we have no fears. Don't know Lama, don't know Lama, Shir Malach, Viterimko, Viterimko, Yitzir Nibra, Liet Nasav, Chetzukol, Azoy Melech, Shemonikra, Beacha Reiki, Chlotako, Levardo Yimloch Nora. Bahu hoya, bahu hove, bahu ye ye, betif ara. I don't know lam, I don't know lam, I share my lach. Betirim ka, betirim ka, yitzir nivra. Liet nasa, bechep tzokol, as I melech shemoni kra. Bahu echad be ain't sheni, laham shelo lahach mira. Balireshit, balitachlit, balahaz baham isra. I don't know lama, I don't know lama, shir malach. Beterim ka, beterim ka, yitzir nivra. Liet nasa, vechep tzukol, as I melech shemoni kra. Behu eili, bechoa goali, betzur chibli beet zara. Bahuni si umanos li, menad go si biyom ek ra. I don't know lam, I don't know lam, I share my lach. Beterim ka, beterim ka, yitzir nebra. Liet nasa, vechep tzokol, as I melech shemoni kra. Beyado, apki druchi, beet ishan beyaira. Ve'im ruchi gaviyati Adono eli velo ira Adono lam, Adono lam, Asher molach Veterim ka, veterim ka, Yitzir nivra Li'eit na'asa v'chet tzokol Asay melech shemo nikra Shabbat shalom. Have a wonderful, wonderful Shabbat.